Deer piss. Uh, <laughs> welcome back God, to Super the... Mario 64. Let's catch a bunny. Oh God, bunny this piss. Again. <laughs> okay, so what you may not have known is that this bunny actually has two stars that are exactly the same. Because Nintendo got lazy and they couldn't figure out. They yeah, didn't like put in another level. They were like five give, stars, they couldn't figure out. Yeah, exactly. Give some of them to the toads, give some of them to this bunny, whatever. Oh. Okay, so, this this is gonna really show... How like, many, many times speed is this at? This is four times speed. So however long this takes, it's times just four. multiply it by four, and that's how long I was chasing this goddamn bunny. I, I don't think I could do that kind of complex Four is math. also the number of beers you drank before this I video. I know, I can't. Nope, five. Oh. So, multiply how sober he was when he was doing this by five, and then you get something. <laughs> Your piss. Yes. That's a good way of looking at it. Uh. Okay, seriously, can't you just start cutting things out now? No, you have to see the whole thing. <laughs> You're lucky I'm not playing this at full speed. Yeah, I was gonna say, like, it's been like almost a whole minute already. <laughs> Screw you. But we finally caught him, and so, now we never have to do that again for real. So it's about like four minutes. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Man. Ugh. A well-earned star, Vickers. Exactly, I I deserve that shit. Here we go, indeed. <laughs> oh, by the way, this this dude who's here, his name's Scurvy Kip. Chris, oh, yeah, his name. Yes. Yeah. Hi, Scurvy Kip. Hey. How's it going, everyone? <laughs> Sorry. Now, now we're gonna get to the actual content of the level. Now that we've actually introduced Scurvy the Kip, alias Deer Piss. Mm. Yes. So I wonder why they like my something awful forum name. Yeah, my something awful forum name is actually Scurvy Deer Piss. <laughs> I love in jokes. Um. So what were we gonna ask? I wonder why they like hid this level. Yeah, like, this of all places. I I don't know. It's like the only they time just... they do it too. Oh wow. Mm -hmm. yeah. It didn't actually take you as long to do that as I thought it would. Nope. We, we don't need to go through the whole rest of this level, we're gonna use shortcuts as much as we can. Thank god. There's that fly guy I was talking about, by the way. And honestly, as cool as the wing cap is, fuck that. Oh yeah, shell surfing. <laughs> can you- I like how the music restarts. Yeah, that, yep. was, that was nice. If only you could fly while on the shell. Wow, I just didn't realize you could go on that sand while you're on the shell. Oh yeah, the shell makes you invincible to everything, unless you hit a wall, in which case in this level you die instantly. <laughs> this level's kinda mean. <laughs> that's kinda the theme of this level, instant death. Pretty much, like, anything you can see that's what, moving, what? or... Don't, don't even ask. It's like, where'd you Anything go? you can see that's moving is probably going to kill you in this level. What, what, are, you, what are you doing? I don't really know why they decided to do that. Well, right now I'm actually trying to get off of this, and that palm tree is not very without, good Oh, without for killing a... yourself? Yeah, exactly. It's, it's, it's really much more difficult than it sounds in this level, because everything is trying to kill you. Except, yeah, especially with your feet. On the plus side, there's this wall here, so eventually I just decide that that's much easier. <sighs> yeah, there's quite a few quicksand pits here. That too! Those will also kill you, shockingly enough. Anyway, as for actual progress, the star that we're looking for is right there, in the talons of the oh, big wow. bird. Yep. Wow. That was easy. The bird is kind of a meaty pants. <laughs> you just made that star your bitch. Exactly. If if you stand on any of the or if you stand on these two of the four pillars, the bird is just gonna fly right next to you, so you can just jump on him. Also, that is. Do you show off the Easter egg with the bird? Unfortunately, he gets a lot more annoying once you steal his star. Yeah, like I said, he's a meaty pants. <laughs> but I guess we'll see that later. I was just opening up the cannon here so that I wouldn't have to do it later. Not that you really need the cannon for anything. These pillars confound me. Yeah. Yeah. What's up with Their them? Their mystery will be explained soon enough. No, it won't. It'll remain a mystery for the entire time. Crap. Well, <laughs> no matter what mystery they have, will the mystery of why they let you defy gravity ever be solved? Nope. I thought that was the only mystery of them. Well, I thought yeah, that was that's... the power of... That, those, that's the power of the courage of the stars. Oh, of course. They let Mario run up... I don't know, 80 degree surfaces. <laughs> sure, why not? No, that's, I'm pretty sure that's like a 90 degree wall. <laughs> well, yeah, but that's like the only 90 degree wall he can do. Nope, there's one other one. Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> You're just 
just not getting anything right today, are you? <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah, today. Unfortunately, neither am I because I can't get up this damn wall. Oh, after, after oh, last time. I think Mario's had one too many. <laughs> yeah, he's not the only one. <laughs> it doesn't matter if he's had one too many. He's hitting his head into things. <laughs> That's a good point. If he's so concussed, the beer won't really do much. Well, I never, I never specified one too many beers. One too many there clothes ahead. On the plus side, this star is really, really any, easy. You know, any, any amount of blows to the head is probably too many. <laughs> Especially when you're just jumping headlong into walls. Or cannoning into them, as the case may be. Here mm. we go. Well, that's what I do on a Saturday night. I don't know about I'm you. <laughs> I'm really happy that you don't have to run to do a triple jump with the wi with the wing cap. Oh yeah, that, that's a really that like a to ask. it lets me do this so that I can actually jump on top and make this star completely trivial. Oh yeah, this star. Oh, I wow, always like to go with the old-fashioned way. You're, you're supposed to run yeah. around the entire pyramid, but I am having absolutely none of that because if you start sliding at all, you're going to fall into quicksand and die. <laughs> Stop being such a scrub and get on my level. <laughs> a foot scrub. I'm sorry. Have you looked at the, top, the bottom left corner of this video? Scrub that bitch. <laughs> I don't want to scrub your feet. <laughs> I, I kind of do. They're kind of filthy. Sorry. <sighs> Never gonna get away from that, am I? Anyway. <laughs> okay, so... At least your socks. Wash your socks. They are washed. No, they're not. They just have gray on the tips, because they're Hanes. Yep. Yeah, yeah, I'm sure. <laughs> anyway, Hanes. we have to get the 100 coin star at some point, and honestly, there's really no way around this. But that's, this is going to be that's boring. Kind of How many dick times do you die on getting this coin? That's kind of a dick coin. This is the only view of it, but I died at least twice. <laughs> How long take it slow. You actually get it. <sighs> There's nothing you can do here. See, what our viewers at home can't really see is that there's a ledge here that causes you to slide down and straight into that quicksand if you don't get it right. And I'm kind of falling it off he off of it here, but... The the annoying thing is that you literally can't tell if you're on it or not by the end of it yeah. unless you're falling off of it. But that's out of the way. N64 textures, strike again. Yep. Anyway, coin star on this level, it's most of the coins are in the part of are in a part of the level that we haven't even seen yet, but we have to spend most of our time getting all the rest of the coins out here. Huh, I forgot that Mario could punch those things. I thought you had yep. to shell them. Nah. The shell does make pretty good pretty quick work of them though. But what did that, that coin get? That huh. cone phase <laughs> through the that, co Don't that coin phase <laughs> through the ceiling. Oh my god! <laughs> See, you noticed that, but I didn't. So what? at this point, I had just considered that coin lost to the ether. Oh god, what the hell? Nice. Also, Lakitu doesn't really like this area very much, because he gets no. caught on things all the time. He's jealous, because you're in the shade. Exactly. He's he's very hot right now, well, and he's... that coin is also lost well, he's to in a, Sam. He's in a coin, or... Uh, he's in a, in a cloud. Those are just like rain, <laughs> rain water. Good try. I remember playing this level. Well, this cloud's probably evaporating here. The longer he's in here, the <laughs> less he has, the less like, time he has left. Like if there was like a time limit, <laughs> and then your camera just disappears. <laughs> I always kind of hate this area because it can be a little difficult to tell which sand kills you. Just assume the floor is lava, or in this case, quicksand. That's a good point, yeah, but the texture there will suck you in slowly and kill you if you wait for like 10 minutes without jumping. But other than that, it's pretty safe. If you just want to take a quick sand bath. Yeah, exactly. That foggy crap. Is... Kills you instantly. Yeah. 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 That, that is the worst part of this level. That and the uh, little bit around the pyramid. That's also true, because that kills you too. Everything kills you forever. On the plus side, if you're on the shell, this sand, which is supposed to kill you instantly, will not. What I wanna know is, uh, what the hell that crap is. Is that, like, poison fog or some shit? I'm not sure. Yeah, like, I know why they made a different color. Super quick sand! <laughs> yes, exactly. <laughs> it's so quick, it, it just rises up and kills you. You know how Inuits have, like, 16 words for snow? This level has, like, 16 <laughs> types of sand. We're talking about Eskimos again? How many words do they have for deer piss? <laughs> See? No one actually heard our conversation about Eskimos. This is completely new to them. 
<laughs> so? Also deer piss. <laughs> um, yes, that's the joke. Yeah, for those of you not in the know, go look uh, that up. Was, was it even the... I, I don't even remember. I read it on my crack article. Of course, it was a crack article. About how deer piss is hallucinogenic and how Eskimo shaman drink it. Nah, there, now, now you know everything. Also, good thing about Whoa, the shell. You just, you just hit that bird. Holy it crap. beats the shit out of the bird. By the way, the bird's name is Klepto. I'm sure that you wanted to know that. I, I'm sure there's oh, a very good reason for that. more interesting than deer piss. I'll update the Mario Wiki as we speak. <laughs> I'm pretty sure it's already on there. Yeah, I was going to say, just kidding. I'm sure they have it. <laughs> of course they have it. So this is this is the canon in the level, and you could go through the entire level without even really knowing that it's here or using it all. But it is a quick shortcut right here, so that I can get the wing cap and then dick around a lot more. I think you mean playing footsies. Yes. I think you mean shut up. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I'm not gonna get that coin. <laughs> I know, all that excitement was building just for me to miss it. It was kind of hard for me to do with my hands. Uh, the the red feet. coins in this level are evil, but we'll get to that later. I always just hop in the cannon and it's easy for me. I guess I'm just too pro. I guess you're just too good at this game with your hands. <laughs> well, uh, how do you know I didn't do it with my feet? <laughs> how do you know I'm point. not an idiot Shaw, man? Whoa, you better watch out for that, Mario. <laughs> yep. I think those wait, twisters just wait. exist to annoy the crap Mario's, out of you. Well, since when did Mario become Hagger? <laughs> That's an awesome double lariat. <laughs> Didn't even cost him any health. Nope. But even if it had, we could just grab some coins anyway, if I could ever get up the slope. There's another one of those like hidden texture slopes right there, by the way. And this box. This level is kind of full of them, and it's annoying. Yeah, they, they, they do a pretty good job of having it blend in with everything Yeah, it's really else. nice how they manage to make their textures indistinguishable. Blend in at the exact <laughs> moment when you wouldn't want them. Anyway. We have 57 coins now, and it seems we've depleted most of the level. I wonder where... Oh, fuck. Oh. Stole your hat! What the hell? What oh, did you, well, what now did we you? know why he's called Plecto. <laughs> I was, I was gonna, yep, I had to demo this, of course. Demo, I don't right. think yeah. that was a demo as much as he ganked your hat while you were stuck in the sand. <laughs> Are you actually going to take all this time to get it back? <laughs> How many postcards did you send in to win that hat? He can't let Klepto win. <laughs> but yes, one of the mechanics of this game that hasn't really been shown off till this point is that you can lose your hat in very specific circumstances, and if you do that, you take double damage. Because the game hates you. Also, you get a nasty sunburn. That too. And if you lose it, like, can't you, like, do you not get well, it back, or what, or like... Well... I'm trying to remember, like... There's, there's a specific it. instance where that happens, but... If you lose it in this level, Klepto just keeps it for yeah. like, like until you steal it back from him. Yeah, that's what I meant. Anyway, welcome to the rest of the level. AKA the fun part. <laughs> Honestly, I think that this is a much better level than the level outside. Like, than the actual main part of this level. It's a lot less easy to die randomly, I like that. that, that, that yeah, that's definitely a good part. Pyramids are pretty cool. That said, it's very, very large, so this, I decided uh... that four times music is very calming. Isn't it, though? Underground theme again, which is the which cave is... theme in Mario, <laughs> for those of you who weren't aware. <laughs> God. <sighs> I didn't realize that. <sighs> I thought I was just gonna post a YouTube comment, then some goons said, wait, really? <laughs> ah, story of my life. Anyway. Goons, as smart as YouTube. <laughs> but yeah, this is a very large, this is probably the largest subsection of, like, any level. It's pretty much like a full level in and of itself. Also, those swamps are mummified. Yep, I, I kind of like that, it's a nice touch. And they're very happy. They've also got, like, a, yeah, like, a kind of different face or something. Like... Most swamps are kind of, like, not happy. Nope, yeah. these guys, they're wrapped in, I don't know, cloth and happy. Just, also, I am... I have gotten tired of how slow swinging on ropes is, <laughs> or swinging on those things is. So, like, you just don't for the entire to rest that. of the LP, yes, for the entire rest of the LP, it'll be speed. They'll be sped up. This is your promise to us. Or is it more yes. you just don't want to subject yourself to that again? Oh, stop teleporting! Cut. 
That too. <laughs> it's like, at least give us some warning when you're going to make a random jump cut. Nope. Yeah, I mean... <laughs> it's, it's not even... Uh, it's, God damn it. <laughs> it's not even worth it. There we go. Or you can at least yeah, that gimmick it. is kind of played out by now. You know what the funny thing is? Even though I'm moving at four times speed, I'm still going about as fast as I would running in a normal place when I'm on the th when I'm on the grates. Yeah. So it's not even like you're missing anything. Like the coins will speed up, but Mario will just keep going on his leisurely pace. <laughs> I don't know why they made you move so slow and like. Yeah, I did not like the grates. I ended up just jumping into that little sand river there and just jumping mm -hmm. repeatedly. Another type of thwomp, which is an you oil You were just barrel. pretending it was Quake. You were bunny hopping. Yes, exactly. Sorry. The thing about, le <laughs> the thing about <laughs> shifting sand land, I was about to say lethal level. Aren't you a little young to play Quake at? Um, it's yes. for your time, isn't it? <laughs> oh. I'm never gonna get to talk about the level. <laughs> just no. start, start talking. <laughs> Uh, the thing about shifting sandland is that because this section is just so enormous, it kind of ends up being like one and a half levels in and of itself. So I think a lot of Which... people got a really negative image of it because of all the instant death sand, well, and then it... suddenly you get in gear and the level's gigantic. Well, it makes up for uh, the next level. The next level, which we totally haven't commentated already. I'm Vickers, I swear to God, you keep doing this. Yeah, it's like I even caught myself and said next level instead of previous level. And it's still, you do that. <laughs> I have no choice. Anyway, you have a choice! It's like you don't care about continuity or something. <laughs> well, neither does Mario. By the way, guys, we recorded Dire Dire Docs before this. Yeah, thank you, thank you. <laughs> God. <laughs> I don't know how Why many of you, my viewers are gonna get the subtext. The level for all two people who haven't played this game. Why are you LPing this drunk? <laughs> I'm not drunk. I'm tipsy. Stand tall on the four pillars. Oh, j by the way, standing tall on the four pillars, it opens the top of the pyramid. Ha! <laughs> oh, <laughs> you've beaten me to it, good sir. I am having so much fun. Wow, spoilers. But uh -huh. there isn't a spoiler in this game because he even said so. Well, exactly. Fuck him. I didn't know that yet. Bowser dies at the end, or does he? <laughs> well, no, there's like a time loop or something, so he keeps coming back to life. <laughs> He's Dracula. <laughs> Dracula. Dracula has time loops. I was gonna talk about the star, but fuck you guys. I already talked about the star. Well, someone, someone already spoiled it. Yeah. That's it. This, this star. What we just did right here, this pillar, is the biggest dick because if you notice, it's buried in the killer, in like the sand that will kill you instantly. Like if I even go onto that little gradient, I'm dead. So you have to kind of find creative methods to get onto that one pillar. Like not playing with your feet. <laughs> of course after this, the whole rest of the thing is a cakewalk. Oh wow, that really is a double lariat. Yep. <laughs> you kill the shit out of those things. Also, because we had to add this thing in the video somewhere. Wait, you haven't, you haven't yep. showed this off yet. Those There's... things are dicks. <laughs> There's some very angry cubes that want you it's dead. Very happy well, some cubes. of them are happy. It's a very crying cubes. Some of them are very unsure of things. Maybe crying a little bit. I don't know. But yeah, this this section is easy, and all those pe and all of you people who died a billion times on it, screw you. That was me. <laughs> <laughs> I was always a. Uh, I figured I couldn't take the easy route out I, every time. I always assumed that you had to ground pound those pillars. See, watch, 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 watch. Oh god. Oh, huh. Wow, you so called. BAM! <laughs> <laughs> now we just have to get in. Well, that's your problem, not mine. That's a good point. I am the one playing this game. Like, a month ago. Jesus, yeah. Vickers, why don't you just play. Why don't you just play uh, Streets of Rage? I could do that. F final fight? <laughs> the, or final fight, whatever. <laughs> One of those early... The game that has Hagger in it. That's all you yeah, need to know. Like, I was like, I'm pretty sure... Like... <laughs> no, I... You just got your reference wrong. Come on, man. Yeah. I thought I was the one who was drinking. I'm tired, okay? Anyway, <laughs> the great thing about being able to just, like, triple jump in place with the wing cap is that we can stand on top of those pillars and go straight here instead of doing that terrible, terrible walk around the pyramid thing. By Again. the way, Streets of Rage and Final Fight are pretty much the same game, so don't blame me for mixing I, them all. I've never played either of them, I don't know. I just know what Hagger is from. So yeah, this whole, the whole point of getting this star is actually to do something completely unrelated and get to this little tiny crack right here that you actually can do without doing the pillars. 
Just so you know. Come on, Lucky Do. <laughs> no, no, he has to stay up there. <laughs> oh, he's, God. he's gonna join us eventually. Yeah, come on. <laughs> Here's a boss that a lot of people probably don't even know exists. Are we playing Wind Waker? Yep. It's basically the same boss except without arrows, and instead with fists. So it's it's very different. Or in our case, battle foot to foot. <laughs> yeah. Oh, there you go. There we go. So yeah, this is um some mummy who probably has a name in the Mario wiki that I don't know. <laughs> but it's not a mummy? Hey, oh no, there's a mummy like in the tomb thing. I'm oh, there's a star in there. Oh. There's probably also a mummy. Well, the mummy turns into a star. There we go. Perfect. It's morbid. <laughs> well, it's a mummy. It's already morbid. Anyway, this boss is really easy. It looks like this boss just got rocked. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh. Okay, he, look. He already said crushed like pebbles, so you're in good company. <laughs> <laughs> I guess I can't get mad, but... I can. Fuck you. Okay. <laughs> Fair enough. But yeah, there, there's a star that I didn't get until, like, way later when I was playing this game. When I was, like, an adult. <laughs> adult? Yeah, right. A young adult, jeez. He's, he's older than you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you're not one to talk at her. I didn't say you're I was like an adult! Only one that, you're, like, the only one that's less than 20 years old. <laughs> That's a good topic to talk about. It's not like we have anything interesting here. We're just collecting yeah, that's red our, coins. Our, our exact age is like, yeah. make, it, make it easier for people to stalk us. <sighs> I'd say my exact age, but then I'd have to say that I'm in Canada, because if not, then I was illegally drinking, and that just me is a whole liar. <laughs> I'm in Canada for this one video. Well, you just admitted it already. I think you, anyway. you kind of outed yourself there. <laughs> I'm not outing anything. I'm in Canada. Um... <laughs> Collecting this shell and collecting some red coins. Yep. In Canada. In Canada. I, I will say that I, I have a birthday in like a month. Two months, <laughs> sort of. <laughs> Let's make it really obvious. A new custom title. <laughs> I wasn't aware that that was how it worked. I'm just going to take every single rock pun I can find and make it your custom title. Who are you, you see worm? Us worm. I'm sure you can think of a lot of rock puns too. Yeah, just check the Metroid Prime thread. Oh! Wow, you're, you're late re reference. User was brand banned for this post. Oh snap. For all of you in the archive who have no sense of when all these videos were posted, this this LP happened like after the, <laughs> but the Mario 64 one was finished. They won't know when no, this one is. there'll be people who are wondering. They'll know when, when the Mario Prime thing was, but not this one. Mario Prime. Mario Prime. God damn it. <laughs> First person Mario. See, that would be no, but see, when you watch it in the when you watch it in the archive, you have like it's completely detached from any sense of time. Why are we talking about this? <laughs> because there's nothing else to talk about. <laughs> Four of the coins of this level are in the air, and that's it. There's nothing interesting about them. <laughs> By the way, if he tries to steal your hat when you have the wing cap on, nothing happens. Oh, now you're using the cannon, scrub. <laughs> I didn't even know about that teleport. Yeah, wow. Yep. Crap. If you stand in the palm shade, it teleports you to the cannon. Wasn't there... oh, well, I guess we'll... I also like how the texture is, like, on top of the cannon, so that if you fall in, you're falling into, like, the quicksand tet thing. <laughs> See, I don't even really get anything from the cannon, so fuck your white cannon. Ugh. Oh, what? come on. No, Vickus. <laughs> Turn up, Vickus, no! <laughs> we got this. We got this so good. God, no, we don't. <laughs> We're gonna make you watch the whole thing now. Why am I so invested in this? <laughs> yeah, why are you so invested in this? Is this like a surprise to you or something? We're gonna get it! I wonder what happens when he gets all these. <laughs> By the way, this is this is the very first point where I actually realized that I missed this coin right here. You probably should save that one. Good job! Like, the easiest one in the entire level. <laughs> Pretty much wow. every other one is trying to kill you somehow, that's the one I forget. That's the freebie. <laughs> well, not like the freebie really matters, because you need all of them. Mmm. -hmm. Yeah. I mean, it, it could be worse, they could have put it in that Shy Guy. <laughs> That's so Kaizo. I don't really know how that would have worked. <laughs> yeah, exactly. I think I'm gonna get it on this pass, but I have no guarantee. You know what would be really Kaizo? If they put it in one of the tornadoes that pop up. Ooh. 
with the chain shop. I wonder what Kaizo this place looks like. I bet it's all quicksand that you die on. I don't know what that <laughs> looks like. It's all that, like, sand miasma crap. Because I really don't have any other way to describe it. Miasma sounds good. I like it. It's miasma. Yeah, that's a good word. It's, it's a cleverer word than I would have thought of. What was that word? Gunk? Miasma. No, your word. Oh, my word? I probably would have just called it quicksand. Again. Red quicksand. <laughs> Everything is quicksand. <laughs> oh, purple. <laughs> we're, now we're running on the slow quicksand, which doesn't eat you very fast. <laughs> Over here we have the instant quicksand. And there we have the gaseous quicksand. Ready in three minutes or less! <laughs> <laughs> Well, On the plus side, we're gonna get to go back to the cool, the cool part of this level. So let's do that if I can put the cap on. <laughs> At least it's not falling in quicksand. So how many stars left in the level? We're we're almost done. We're... I think there's there's one left. I mean, yep, this is it. Not much time oh. left. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna collect yeah, the last well, five stars real quick. I I like to keep myself in suspense and have it on number of frames rather than time. Well, I don't. <laughs> What are we on? 40,000? At this point, I just didn't care. I can check. Yeah, how many frames are we? <laughs> uh, around 47,400. I see. Yeah, this is a better way to do this. No. No. Is there actually a better That's way to do this? That's how I did it. Yeah, there, there's a much better way to do this. You go to the top, and then you time. drop down, and so you don't have oh, to fight so you, the sand oh, current. Huh. Yep. For and so then you realize, at this point, that you can't actually get up there, so... Whoops. I'm so silly. But that's how you get to the handy place with jump out. cut. No, we would never jump cut. Aww. Fade is all up in this bitch. Yeah, no, except don't. with a, a button. <laughs> oh, fine. Use one now. Anyway, what you're what you're supposed to like, do with this stuff? You're just uh, very selective about which ones to use. <laughs> exactly. It's it's kind of the point where I get fed up with this shit when I'm editing it versus the point where I'm still putting effort in. Except this is at the end. Ah, but see, there was a screw-up while I was editing this video. <laughs> oh, do tell. <laughs> nope, we're at the end of the video. You don't even need to know no, about let's, it. Yeah, let's not talk about this. Oh, no, there's still time for you to fuck up this video more. Anyway, like the fifth star in the first level, the wing cap one, you have to collect five coins and you get little numbers pop up and suddenly a star appears, because that makes sense. Sure. That's well, the game the manual doesn't again. make any sort of message, like, doesn't really mention this or and, anything like that. Like, the game calls it a puzzle, but, like, it's come on. To collect the coins. Yeah, it's not, that's not a fucking puzzle. Here we go. And it's really actually just touch the air in the spot near the coins, because that's what sets off those things, as we'll see in a later level. Yeah. Ooh, fancy. Mm. That is a generic name for a star. Yeah, that's like <laughs> the biggest thing it. you got. I could have sworn the first part was a pyramid puzzle, but... Ugh, that way. Anyway, we're through shifting sandland. I don't think it's as bad a level as the next level we're gonna have to do. So you mean the you previous mean, level? I hope you enjoyed this level. <sighs> yes. <laughs> <laughs> Guys are so bad at this. God. Uh, uh, hope you enjoyed, guys. Bye bye. I did. Bye. As soon as, <laughs> as soon as Mario falls asleep. falls asleep. There we go. She's tired. So am I. Tired of this game. Oh, ho, 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 ho. We still yeah. have two floors to go, baby. <laughs>